want to raffle off a giveaway in your stream? Now you are in the right place. With the spin wheel layer you can do different types of games. Either you use it to make someone win what you have set as an option, or you let your participants enter the spin wheel and play out the name. But one thing at a time. First of all, let's have the spin wheel. So we go to overlay in the left sidebar and create a new overlay by clicking add overlay. On the left side we click on add layer and under games we find the spin wheel. Now we can place the spin wheel as we like. On the right side under content we find some options to make the spin wheel the way we want it. The first option is manage spin wheel. We will get to that in a moment. Under title we can now enter a title. By default it says play to win. The next option is to enter a subtitle. The one title and the lost title will be displayed on the winning card if it is activated. Below that we have the option to set the duration of the spin. After that we see some checkboxes. Here you can set details such as whether the name or the picture of your item should be displayed or whether the item should be removed once it has been hit. You can also hide the fancy spin button and turn the sound on and off. Show winning modal activates the previously mentioned winning card. Under empty spaces count you can spice up the luck a bit and add some planks. And right below that you can also insert how these spaces should be named. Of course you can set the font and size of the layer under styling and appearance. Since we know you like to have control over everything we have a few more options for you. Let's go back to manage spin wheel and click on it. A new window will open. You are in the wheel items tab. Here you can add what you would like to raffle off the spin wheel. You can give each item a picture and of course name it. Under quantity you enter a quantity if you want to raffle more than one item of the same kind. Now let's switch to the wheel style tab. Here we can colorize our spin wheel individually and give the spin button a picture. Click on save spin wheel and your layer will apply the changes you just made. You may have to click reset game in the right sidebar. The scaffolding is now in place but now we also want to work with it. As already mentioned you can fill the spin wheel via manage spin wheel. But you can also use commands for it. This is very handy if you want to let a mod do the whole thing. Or if you want your viewers to spend for example channel points on it. And surely you don't want to unpack the editor to turn the wheel. Under overlay actions in your commands you will now see new action types. Spin wheel add item, spin wheel remove item, spin wheel reset and send game trigger. All these actions can be added to chat commands, twitch point commands, extension commands and even alerts. In our example we want to show that you are holding a giveaway and the spin wheel should draw the winner. Of course this should not be possible for everyone so we link this with the redemption of channel points. So we go to commands, twitch points and click add command. Thanks to the new creation tool it is very clear and easy to find where we want to go next. So we click on overlay actions. Under type we select spin wheel at item. The next fields pop up and we fill in overlay and layer with the appropriate data for the spin wheel. In title we enter username. This means that the username of the redeemer will be added to the wheel. If we want we can also insert the avatar of the player. For this we use a new variable. So we click the little red variable button and type avatar into the search field. From the three possibilities we choose twitch underscore get underscore avatar. As you can see the variable looks a bit different. We change the word message to username and click add action. Then we click complete on the bottom right. We don't need any other options for our example. Of course you can add options as you like. But we click on next step in the lower right corner. Here we give our channel point a name. 
let's call it giveaway. If you want, you can add a description and decide if the command should appear on your commands page. How many points your viewer has to use is of course up to you. For demonstration purposes, I set it to 1000 and click on next step. The duration is irrelevant in this case and can be very short. In the dropdown, you can still decide if only subs and or followers are allowed to participate or everyone. Theoretically, you could even raffle only among mods or tier 3 subs. Click complete and save. But since I don't want a regular viewer to be able to put himself on the spin wheel more often, I go back into the command per edit pen and go to the point options tab. Here I set that the command can only be redeemed once per viewer. When now one of your viewers redeems the channel point, his name will appear on the wheel. But how to get the wheel to spin? There are two ways to turn the wheel without using the editor. Either you use the interaction feature of OBS and click on the wheel, or you let a moderator turn it. But to do this, the moderator needs a command. So go to commands, chat commands and click on add command. As before, we select overlay actions. Select the type send game trigger and fill in the fields overlay and layer. You can empty the target player field in this example. This field makes sense if you are raffling something and you want the person who spins the wheel to be displayed in the winner card. Click on add action and at the bottom right on complete. Click on next step at the bottom right and name the command. We will call it spin. Click on next step in the lower right corner. Again, the duration is irrelevant. In the dropdown, you should only select user and mod. That means only you and your mods can trigger the command. Click on complete and save at the bottom right. And now the raffle can begin. If you want, you can create commands to delete items or reset the wheel. Please note that you have to write the message exactly as the name is written on the wheel. How will you use the spin wheel? Write it in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a luminous day.